Hello, my name is Rachel with Guru Dental and in this tutorial video I'm going to show you how to do a workstation installation of Guru Teach software version 7. Now in order to do this installation you will need to have the Guru Teach server installation already completed on your server computer or another machine acting as the Guru server. If you have not done this step, then please watch the tutorial video on installing the Guru Teach server version first. The first thing that you need to do is run the Guru setup file, which you should have either on a disk or have downloaded it from the internet or flash drive. Go ahead and find that setup file and right click and run as administrator. Once you do that, it's going to lead you to this next screen. You're going to go ahead and click Next. Go ahead and click I accept the terms of this license agreement and click Next. You can change this if you would like or leave it as it is and click Next. It's going to automatically install Guru in the C drive under Program Files x86. If you want to change that, you can do that right here and then click Next. Now you're going to want to select the installation type and on this one we're going to choose the Guru Teach Workstation Install. We've already done the server install, so go ahead and click Workstation Install for every workstation that you want to install Guru on. You're going to choose that and then click Next. Here you're going to want to enter your server name, so whatever that is, or your IP address for the server, and then you'll click Next. Then you're going to go ahead and click Install. I have sped up this portion of the video, so it will take longer in reality, so be patient. Once the process is completed, you will see this, and it will say completed, and you'll want to click finish. Once it's completed, go ahead and X out of that, and you will see this icon on your desktop that says Guru Teach underneath it. Go ahead and double click on that, or right click and click open. Once the software is launched, you are going to open up and you'll see this main screen. You're definitely going to want to enter in your credentials for the houseofguru.com. So go to this icon, the settings gear icon right here. Go down to email and you're going to want to enter in your credentials for the houseofguru.com. It's an email and a password. If you don't have your credentials for the houseofguru.com, please give us a call at 888-331-4878 and we can get those for you. Once you've entered your credentials for the houseofguru.com, go ahead and click Save Changes. You'll then see this box appear. Please enter the verification code. You're going to have to go check your email for the houseofguru.com that you use and check and there will be an email there, there that will have a verification code. It's a six digit code that you'll need to enter here. Once you've retrieved that code and entered it here, go ahead and click confirm. And that will save and update your houseofguru.com credentials. Next, you can go to your home screen and choose one of your favorites here and play through one of the videos and make sure that Guru is playing the videos properly. If it is, then you know that you have installed Guru. That is it. Your Guru Teach version 7 software is now installed. I hope this tutorial video has been helpful. Thanks so much for watching.